Hello everybody and welcome back to House Flipper One Weekend. Today, I think, we are going to be finishing the Pink Kingdom. We've done a whole lot of work inside here and I think it's looking pretty snazzy. We do have to paint the garage though, so that is going to be our job today. I think I'm going to leave the tiles on the floor though because if they not actually we did paint the garage what am i talking about <laughs> we have painted it it's not purple anymore i'm going mad okay that's fine it's the house we have to paint Ooh, that's gonna be fun okay so i think it's looking pretty darn good and I'm wondering what color we should paint. Should we paint the lighter pink or the brighter pink? Let's see. If I look at... Why am I there? If we look at the trees... we Yes, I know it's the flower beds, but they've got the trees here. We've got the lilac and the common lilac. So the, the lilac, we have the pink one, the white one, and the violet one. So let's see what color the pink one is. That's very bright pink, isn't it? Maybe let's go for the white one. I think that'll look pretty good there. What do you say? It's not truly white. It's got a lavender undertone to it. Come on, let me plant you, please. Thank you. Okay, so. Well, that's maybe not going to be enough, and I suppose we should figure out what color that is. I didn't look back at my paints at my video to see what color it was i think it's the one okay so it's i think these are the ones amused flamingo no Cotton candy is quite grey. Don't think that's bright enough. Let's try that one and see what colour we have. Okay, that's very pretty. It might be a little dark. This is the one that we've got the big bucket for here. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. I think let's use that. It's still a, a pink. But it is definitely... What am I doing? I'm pushing E. Why am I pushing E? Okay, let's fill it up from there and then just do that. And I think it changes to the right colour. Yes, it does. Love the gun. Paint gun. As long as you don't go inside with it, it's a happy thing. Just a slightly more subtle pink. We're going to put a lot of stuff outside. We've got to plant a pool and a garden. And yes, I think that's just a little bit more subtle. And what 
what we have. Ooh, that didn't go very far, did it? so awesome that it actually goes and then of course we got our climbing tool as well which we will use I think that furniture is a little bit bright for a more subtle pink but that's okay we can figure it out Please tell me I didn't spray inside. No, I didn't. <laughs> I got a little worried there. Uh, we're gonna need the. Oh, yeah, the paint gun actually disappears, doesn't it? Oh, the paint gun is also finished. Let's. Oops. <laughs> Sorry for making you dizzy. <sighs> That's finished. That's nearly finished. That's done. That's done. Spread, so clearly I missed a spot somewhere. There we go. All right, let us deploy our climbing tool, shall we? As we'll get. All done. Everybody happy? Awesome. Oh, we missed that spot, didn't we? Oops. Oh, and the side here as well. Okay, we're gonna need to pull up. But let's pop up there, shall we? And see how far we get on the side here. Uh, one day I will remember not to get confused between the two games and the control. You can do it. Damn it. It was empty. At least we can climb over the roof now. It's that whole section there. Okay. Hello, little tree. You're very pretty. We need to get up there. So it's still pink, it's still intensely pink, but it's pretty pink. Well, the bright pink is pretty, but it's not as intensely pink. Makes sense. 
Nope, not that one. That one. Uh, let's jump up here and see how, how we do. I suppose we should try and finish that one before we run out of paint. do it. Oh wow, we did. I think. That's way better. All right, I am going to sell these chairs. Table. Yeah, we'll sell the table as well because. And that. Ooh. And some grass. There we go. Because I'm thinking of mostly white furniture. I think that'll be really pretty. I can we sell it? Yes, we can. Awesome. more than happy to leave the side there but I think we need to move out. Let's just see what we've got here. The big ones. Let's, okay, I'm gonna do this and if I mess up really badly, I'll be fine. Go. Let's find us some surfaces, paving slab. That is very pretty. And it's almost pink. Let's have a look here. If I put it here. Oh, look at that. How pretty literally got a hint of pink to it. That will work. Seriously? to do that, you're going to have to leave. And then I'm going to pull the patio out so that we can actually have a really nice place to sit, relax, look at the pretty flowers. We've got lots of flowers in this game. I wish we had in the other game. I wish we had the trees from the other game in this game. That's me just getting greedy. I want it all. I want everything. I think let's go as far as this little tree here. I don't want to chop it down. That would be sad. Can we add one in there? No, we can't. Alright. So let's do it this way then. There should be a Awesome. Okay, let us find a pool, shall we? I'm a big fan of this pool.
exactly we want. Yes, we do. Alright. Light grey. Hmm. That would be fun. What do you think? We haven't got anything that's going to match here, but the pink will pick up. And it's not the right pink, and there's nothing we can do about that. But, that's okay. I think that's even. Is that even? line up on the sides but that's okay because we're going to do some plants and flowers and stuff and all kinds of prettiness so plants I don't think we've got anything that is really pink I think these ones mm, we might have a red I think we have a pink. These plant literally on top of each other to make a nice show. So, yay, that'll work. Do these? No, they're only blue. And green. Chrysanthemums are pink, a little intense, but it's okay, but they're not, there isn't enough space for them, which is unfortunate. The anemones are also quite big, but there's a spot, awesome, you can live with that. I think these are able to fit in gaps. We can have a couple of little flowers here and there in a month. There's a big one on the outskirts. have a pink one. Can I 
sneak it in. doesn't work right there. I would prefer to put it sort of behind so that it shines to light up through the plants. Not that you can see it very well. It's a little short, isn't it? There we go. Much better. And then we've got some sculptures that aren't big. Well, we have the pink flamingo, which we will be using. Do we want yellow legs on our pink flamingo? I think so. I used to live in a complex, townhouse complex, that um, the people in the governing body at the townhouse complex in their infinite wisdom, decided to buy some pink flamingos to put at the entrance of the complex. And it was interesting. <laughs> and we have people on the side of the road here that sell beadwork that's on metal frames, stuck on metal string, metal wire. And they actually made the flamingos out of beads. Very pretty. Very pretty indeed. So the question I have is, do any of these have pink stone? <laughs> Gonna have to do a blue half, don't you agree? Got a lot of blue stuff. Can we really have the natural one that will work here? Not quite what we're looking for, but it will work nicely here next to the pool. You can actually hear the water while you're sitting in the little is that spa? Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to get another one for them to do. Can I? Can I? I can't quite put them together. It's unfortunate. Why not? Okay. All right. I want some more plants. Yeah, we're going to do lots and lots of pink plants. Oh, flower beds. All right. The bugle lily comes in pink, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, it does. Look how big that is. Very intense. If that's pastel rose, what is that? I I I wouldn't call that pastel rose, guys. which also comes in pink, also intensely pink. That's fine. We are going all in with this. I hate that it actually leaves a mark and it's just one of those things we have to live with, unfortunately. I think that's a good start. Let's find We've got the lilac and we've got the common lilac and we've got the oleander. Now 
That is pastel rose and that is pink. So that's not a bad colour. I like it. Did you know that Oleander is poisonous? Okay, that is pink. That's an intense pink again. That is more purple than pink. Way more purple than pink. I think that one's white. That one is violet. Damn it. do it. Yeah. Hate the it doesn't pick it up very easy. Now that is intense. how close I can get them to anything. Can't. Okay, that will work. I wish I could put one just there, but I can't. Let me right, what have we got that's slightly smaller? that one <laughs> it's huge if I fall in hopefully I can get out again Awesome. We have some flowers. We will continue with them. We're... I'm 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 going right through, all through the pink. We start at the bottom now. Do those come in pink? No. Would you call that pink or would you call that red? It's more red. It is pretty, and it does cut that very intense pink of the others. We'll take it. Uh, that comes in pink. The Dahlia does not. our way through. Pop them here and there. I'm going to look for some stepping stones as well. I want to move create 
quite a garden here. But I want to see what else we can find. The dianthus is going to be purple, purple, irises. Those are the little things we were looking at. That's not a nim nim. Ah, we've used those. Okay. Now this is the huge one. Let's use it in the bright pink. What do you say? Huge. And it will be perfect. regular one which is slightly smaller pop one on that side two back to the night ranger the day lilies I'll come back to now this also comes in pink these also quite large. I want some on this side, maybe. We have the roses, meadow sweets do come in pink. Very well, they say pink. We'll take it. I wouldn't call that pink, but who am I? What do I know? I'm going to put a bench here. Pink these. I wouldn't call that pink. Pastel rose and pink. Now the daffodils don't. I think the tulips do. Can I not just put these tulips down? Oh, they're different tulips. Okay, sorry. They look the same to me. Then again, I don't grow tulips. Oh, there's only one pink here. That's sad. Daffodils, we don't have cottage tulips. Yes. I think also very pretty. Come on, give me a space. Thank you very much. I'm going through everything. The Philadelphia lilies are only in red. Okay, so we've got two things here. Yeah? 
Now the Pelagonium come in many, I mean many, many pink, if I'm not mistaken. It's good because they fill in the gaps. is pink. Oh, bright isn't. Then it's red. Okay. Like lily and lily. Okay, those are purple. Okay. Uh, see from the title of that, that that is once again they're tiny which is fine lots of gaps here They're beautiful. Okay, so now I would like a bench. Now, as far as I can remember, none of these benches come in pink. We are now going to have to go with red, which is fine because that was my plan in the first place. Okay, what else do we have here? We have umbrellas don't come in pink. Well, they do! It's an intensely pink umbrella. But you know what? I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna argue with that umbrella. I am going to take it. Thank you for giving me a pink umbrella. I don't think that one hurts. No. Orange joy and raspberry. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, none of those do either. Okay. So I'm going to put some furniture underneath the umbrella. You know, I think that would look pretty cool here. And it'll take your eye away from the fact that there's a big scurry missing in the grass. Now we need a couple of chairs on this side. I know we need sun chairs. I'm not going to go for a full on country, what's it, farmhouse garden. So I'm definitely going to probably go for the Swimming pool, sun chairs, yada 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 yada, with lots of pink. Can't see my, I can't see my flamingo anymore. Let's put him over here. There we go. You'll look stunning there. There we go. Awesome. Now 
we can put recreation rules and fire pits. I would like have they come in different colours yet? No. That's just black. So it's either this one or that one. Should we go for the fancy one? Let's go for the fancy one. And we need some chairs, don't we? And Castle Rose, I think, will be the best fit. to sit and chat while you're cooking, place to relax my pool, I need another light. At least one. I'm sure there will be a place here somewhere. in the garden and obviously these are quite cool that pink umbrella glows <laughs> do we what structures do we have here I want a fire pit, but I wouldn't mind a pond. We have space in the garden for a pond. It will look very cool. problem is we don't have that many don't think we've got any tropical pink plants I'll take a potted palm because I can we'll just pop it here behind the some hydrangeas along there are more subtle pink I 
long as they don't poison the fish, we could. The palm looks a little weird and out of place, but that's okay. It'll be fine. Get one back there. What? It, 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 yes. Come on. There we go. Maybe some rocks. Will we be able to put rocks around? Well, How close can I put this boulder to that pond? That's pretty good. So this is the one that's grapey. That is cool, but oh heck, what the hell? Let's stick it in the on the ground. It'll be fine. No, it won't. Okay, needs a pot. That's where I want the beagle lily to go. Is there another pink here? Yes. I need something else. My hydrangea is so pretty. Some roses. We have some there already. Find some. Day lilies are short. For the short ones, I'm guessing. Yes, they are. We need lots of lots and lots of plants, but I don't have the energy or the money to want to spend on the lots and lots of plants because you never really get it back but we'll plant some greenery in the front because that always brings in some money especially the these things they always are happy when you plant things now where's the big one The big one. Yep, I'd say. Mm. 
And believe it or not, we have a buyer. That is huge, which is awesome. In fact, I want to put another one around the corner here. Did I sell that? I'm sure I didn't. I'm going to sell that because that just looks silly. to use this. Yes, we're using the rose gold. Use this here. Aww. Okay, that's the wrong way around. I thought we use that. never tried to use it before. So, let me know why I can't use it. What does it have to be anchored to, to use? Try and use it here. original plan. See, we got the pink nuts and bolts. There we go. That's pretty. And we need another tree. Maybe a pink lilac. <laughs> Doesn't sound right, does it? Very pretty. Now I would like to put... Just there, in between there. I think that looks okay. But now we need some stuff. So, let's see. We have 
I've got a huge amount of pink plants all outside. In pots on these. Well, I suppose we could. Decoration. Let's see. Can do that in white. It's quite large. Let's see how that. This one. Yeah. Alright, you come in pastel rose, pink, and magenta. So let's find some more pots, shall we? Different sizes and shapes. Don't come in a white. Wonder. Hmm. Don't want to block it. Maybe just those two? Maybe? Okay, that'll work. Awesome. Now what do we have in the way of doorbells? We do, we do have doorbells, but I don't know where you find them. Well, there you go. You're gonna need two for the back so you can actually see what the heck you're doing at. There we go. I also want paving stones, don't I? I mean stepping stones. Why did I say structures? I didn't. I mean surfaces. with the sandy one.
little baby one, but only if you can get more than one little baby one at a time. Do I want anything down here? I don't think so. We'll leave that as is. I would also like something at the door here. I would like a chair. Here it is. That's what I'm thinking of. I mean, how cute is that? If I can't have a swing, I will have a rocking chair. <clears throat> Like that, yeah. Just thinking in my head, I'm thinking maybe a bench on the other side. Don't need a fancy one. I don't think that comes in hot. No, it doesn't. That is unfortunate. Bench and a rocking chair. Why not? I'm going to take a walk through to make sure I've sold everything that I need to sell. And I have completed everything that I need to complete. That is done. It's all done and furnished and decorated and Still not sure about those pictures, but you know what? I'm okay with them as well. We've done our coffee. Desk. I think it's quite cute. But, uh, do we not have a light up here? We don't. It's terrible. You see. Hmm. Doesn't need to be anything big. A little bit long, so that's actually perfect. The bathroom. Good. The bedroom. I need something for that wall, don't I? Do I want hanging or standing? said pastel rose guys mm, it's sort of vaguely pink that'll do <laughs> okay i think this little house eh, we still need something on the walls here don't we what else do we have we don't want chain some hats ok 
looks like it might be no it's not pink that's okay pretend that's pink choose the color of our strip. Is that orange and or is that pink and red? I'm not sure. I'm taking it regardless. That's the same. Okay. It will do. Just something for the wall. Anything else fun? Well, we could go for a Pink Rhino. That is available in Pastel Rose. It almost disappears onto the wall, which is not a bad thing. Okay. I think we are now complete sell the house. We've sold all the, the paint and all the bits and bobs. Uh, submit for garden contest. So this one practical filled with low profile green plants serves as a place for relaxing patio, gazebo, barbecue, swimming pool, the sun shed. That's the one I'm aiming for. The layout's excellent. The equipment, meh. Plant selection, even more meh. Not enough green. Hey, I think I put every pink plant available into the garden. I'm impressed. <laughs> okay, a lot of plants, cleanliness. First participation in this category for over a month. New personal record, I don't think so. But hey, let's take it. Let's auction it off. So, house price, one forty, say one forty three thousand. We spend sixteen thousand. Sold seven thousand. And we only got that's terrible profit of nearly twenty six thousand. I will not negotiate with you. They would like another two and a half thousand, thank you. Or thereabouts. Oh, he might not. Yes, he'll take it. Oh, not any. Oh, damn. Okay. All right. Uh, okay, he won't. All right, I'll have to take his offer. I made 26,000. Which is okay, but hey, look at that. He bought himself the prettiest pink house anybody did ever see. And a pink car to go with the pink house. And I did a really bad job negotiating. But look at that. I think that's very pretty. Okay, so. This farm is driving me a little kooky. I want to buy a new office. We've got six and a half million. We own a whole bunch of property, but just ignore that for now. <laughs> I think what I'd like to do is just buy a little, little place, little boring house, maybe. I don't want any of the bigger ones. I want a teeny one, a little one that I can set up as an office. So it would either be the connoisseur's house the house with uninvited guests, which I think is the cockroaches.
decorated house is the Christmas house. It's not Christmas. And it is it's bigger. It's way bigger than the other two. So it's either connoisseur or uninvited guests. They both much of a much must. They both just under sixty two thousand. I'm gonna go for the cheapest one. And we're going to move our office here. I want to go. I want to go. All our animal can go back to Morgan's Animal Hotel. I don't know where the farm animals go though. So I'm going to have to figure that out. But I think it will be good for us to get back into the, the regular swing of things instead of me pretending to try and be a farmer, which I'm not, and feeling really bad about um, not looking after the animals properly. Because, I mean, you get animals, you've got to look after them. I'm just like ignore them and I have been which is quite sad and I feel really bad about it so yeah I think we and then I will sell I promise once I've done the office I will sell I'm selling all the dolls. I will fix up and sell all the houses that we own. Like that thing, but it's broken. And then, yes, I'm just going around causing absolute havoc. Uh, I hate this because there's always a teaspoon. This house you don't catch it, there's always a teaspoon on the floor while you're trying to do stuff. Yes, I feel bad about the animal. Really bad about the animals. I suppose I should be doing this with my hand, hey? Much, much quicker. Not really, these bottles are still unimpressed with me. Oh, it's a night block! Bye. And ooh, let's see if we can get ah I got rid of the plates. Watch, they stuck in the cobwebs. You can't select them properly. There you go. And we solved the cobweb. Did you see that? I like these cobwebs. They're better than the cobwebs in the new game. Those cobwebs are terrible. They seem to be only one style of cobweb. And you can't really... I've actually... Did you know that if you place rubbish down, you can actually move it with the move tool in sandbox? The only problem with the cobwebs is if you, for example, want to like drape it like that, can't. It falls down and then gets stuck, <laughs> which is quite sad. I'm selling all the dogs. This is the room with the big, big holes in it. That's awesome. Don't know why I'm just in the mood to go back to the original and start like cleaning stuff. And then I promise we will get around to actually building something else in House Flipper One. I have not bought. 
furniture pack that's come out. I want to so badly, but right now it's just not. I can't. So I'm putting money aside because I want to actually buy the new DLC when it comes out. So that is on my wish list. It will, I don't know when it's coming out, but that is what I'm planning to do. And then once I have got that, I'll have a look and I might be able to afford the furniture pack. It all depends on how much the DLC is. And I'd rather save my money for the DLC and not have enough for it. So, there is that. I thought this one had the um, I can't remember what it's called, the DB board or the electric board on the side there, but that's another house. The tiles are so clean there that you can see the, the reflection of the window. Oh, it's awesome. Hmm. I didn't sell you. There we go. strand of cobweb hanging from the ceiling. That's quite funny. Alright, so this is going to be the office. I'm not going to do anything too crazy with it. I probably will... Ooh, that wasn't on the mini-map. Probably going to bathroom, bedroom, office, kitchen, but very simply, and I'm going to leave the pets in the motel. Again, I'm not sure what to do with farm animals or how that works, but we'll figure it out. Cobweb, you're going bye bye now. So, I am not going to start the colors in here today, but I would love to hear what colors you suggest for the office. You want, or instead of colors, how about this? Would you like it sort of bright, subtle, or a specific color? Like everything should be in the blue family, or you want it super modern or you want it black and white or you want it all pastel colors i don't know let me know so this will be our office and yes this is a buildable property so we can always add on to the house but i don't know if i want to add on I want to actually get busy and get rid of some of the 
other properties I have, which are many. I've also got the snow cabin that is looking terrible right now. And why? Because I took it and I was trying to measure to build it again in House Flipper 2. So the whole cabin is literally covered in messy tiles all over the place. And it's really funny, it's sad at the same time. So yeah, we can we can do that. I would like to get to 10 million in this game at some stage in the near future. It's not that easy unless you build. Then it does tend to be easier. And we've got moles. Yay! And yes, I will finish up the farm. Um, I've got a bit of thinking to do there. I just got frustrated with the roof. And you cannot really get rid of it easily. So I'm going to maybe have to make it look like something without being something. Does that make sense? show you when we get there but that's going to wait for a while until I'm over my immediate frustration with the place and that's why I don't want to go back there unless I want to and that will happen at some stage there there is I walked right past a large weed. There you are. Ooh, a whole batch of these weeds. I like these weeds. You can just click like crazy and they all go away. Now I've been watching a guy play another little game. Let's contract something. Contract Villa. I'm not a big fan of the way it go, it, it it's it, it's set up because I can see it's going to be frustrating in a lot of ways. But if you're interested, I can try it. So you can let me know about that too. Alright guys, I'm going to leave it here. I hope you're having a good weekend. I hope you are <laughs> happy to get off the farm and back into the suburbs. <laughs> I hope you have a good day and I'll see you all soon. Bye.